Rockstar's Andrew Houston here with another trading tip. I got behind me something that I think you might be interested in hearing about. It's about addressing the three key strategies to help you, you know, get more applicants, get more people wanting to work for your company, especially during the labor shortage. That's what we're going to be talking about today. And we'll talk to you in the flip side. All right, here we are with another trading tip. And we're going to be getting into this right behind me. Three key strategies to help you guys out in getting more people wanting to work for your company. One of the greatest challenges is there's a massive labor shortage. So, you know, you're not the only one facing it. Every other contractor is out there facing it. So what do you do? What can you do differently? And how can you look at this? Let's call it this problem and turn it into one of the best opportunities for you. I want you to pause this video, write down the strategies that I'm covering off as I go through them and we'll get you to do a little mini audit at the end, uh, which is basically just rating yourself in each one of these areas so that you know where to actually start and begin. Okay, let's do this. So there's one, there's two, there's three, three areas that we got to focus in on. We have to focus in on number one, have to make sure that when we are looking for people that we're looking in the right areas. Number two, we have to be seen as the right prize. And what do I mean by the right prize? The right prize as in you need to look better than the current situation that they're in right now. In other words, better than the current employer that they're working for. And we're going to talk about some of the best ways that you can do that. Number three is the right speed. So not only Okay. Do we have to be in the right area? Do we have to be, you know, the right prize, but we have to have the right speed in which in, in how we respond in this. Um, if we don't do that, then we're going to miss out on opportunities and I'll dig a little bit deeper into that one as well. You're getting zero applicants or very little applicants. Then you should be listening on this tricky chip tip. You're getting zero hires. You're getting zero progress or you're not getting, you know, the results that you want in, any one of these three areas, then you should be paying attention to this. At the end of the day, let's just come up with what the core principle is on growing our company. We are out to scale our company beyond us. Okay. To get our profits to pay for our freedom. If you don't look at leveraging people as a way to grow your contracting business beyond you, then it's just going to be you and you're going to be stuck. Okay. If something is, uh, was to happen to you, God forbid, Maybe you get COVID, maybe, you know, I, like I said, God forbid you get in an accident or you go to go away on vacation and everything just will go to shit if you don't get other people to help you out and to offload some of those hats, which you're probably wearing way too many hats right now to begin with. The right area, okay? We've got to make sure that we are in some of the key areas when it's coming to looking for people. Social media, maybe you're listening to me and you're going, yeah, okay, Andrew, I get it, but I just don't have time for social media. Get, you look at guys, that's where one of the greatest ponds are, you know, if we were to go fishing uh, and we're gonna go find prospects, that's the greatest pond worth the most amount of fish, the most amount of prospects for you. And it can be the easiest place. Uh, we're gonna pick a specific one, uh, but some of the social media platforms or areas that you should be focusing in on, definitely uh, Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, you definitely want to be on Google and maybe, you know, that's the one we end with. Let's start with that one. Google has something called Google reviews. And if you go on to Google reviews, your business will pop up there. This is a prime example where you've got to get focus to make sure that you get positive reviews for your company. You know, when a prospect is going to be looking to find out more about your business, or they're going to be looking to work for another electrical contractor, plumbing contractor, or drywall contractor, whatever contractor that is that they're, you know, whatever space that they're in, and they look up, you know, the contractors in their area, you're going to pop up and either it's going to be a good story that they're attracted to, or it's going to repel them. Those areas on social media are going to be looked at all the time by their partners, by their friends, by their family by themselves and we've got to make sure that we're not only in the right area but we are the right prize okay to them wanting to come and work for us you want to make sure you're on social media some of the other key areas that you want to make sure that you're in front of is use leveraging your suppliers leveraging your team you know this is all about you know making sure that you 
are in the right areas and you've got as many lines in the water as possible to land that fish or the land those prospective uh, new hires for you okay so be in multiple areas you know, uh, be seen as the prize, um, post videos, get your team to post videos on Facebook, on social media, on Instagram. Maybe it could be, you know, some camaraderie, uh, maybe getting together on a Friday and, and having sausages, cooking up some sausages or bringing in some lunch for your team and, and recording a video of that. Maybe take them on a trip. Look at people want to go to work now and not just work. They want to go to work and work in a good environment where they're ha actually happy. So if you can show that kind of environment on social media, at these other areas that I talked about, you're going to be seen as the right prize. Okay. And if you don't, then your competition is going to be seen as the right prize. And guess what? They're going to stick with them. Third is the right speed. You've got to be, people are looking for responses right away. And I mean that right away. At Prof for Contractors, we have systems that we, you know, uh, provide to our champion CEOs, uh, people that are part of the Prof for Contractors community. And they have, you know, software and ways in which when an applicant goes and applies, there's an immediate response to that applicant. Okay. And why is that so critical? Tell me that throughout your, you know, the life, the time that you've been in business, that there's not been times where, you know, you didn't get back to somebody fast enough for prospective new hire. And they ended up staying at the place that they were at, or they ended up going and working for somebody else. We've got to be on them right away. Okay. If somebody raises their hand on a Friday or even on a Saturday or even on a Sunday, you've got to have some form of automation so that the, you know, they get a response. Here's the reality. If you don't get number one and number two, get in the right areas and the right prize properly, you're going to get zero applicants. That's going to be the net result. If you do get this right, you're going to get lots of applicants. If you get number two and number three, the right prize, and you become, you know, automated to respond at the right speed, you know, you're going to go from zero hires to actually being able to hire, you know, the people that you need when you need them. Okay. And when we look at um, number three and number one, you know, if we don't get to have the ability to respond at the right speed in the right areas, we're gonna make zero progress. So wrapping this up, you've always gotta be hiring, you've always gotta be seen in the right areas, being the right prize at the right speed. You've always gotta be hiring regardless of whether or not you need somebody right now so that you got a roster so that you, because if you're only hiring when you need people, it's too late, all right? So that's another trading tip from Prof for Contractors, leverage it you know, rate each one of these. I said, I'd get you guys to do an audit. So super quickly, just rate out of 10, each one of these, how are you doing? And whichever one has the lowest number, that's where you start. Whichever one has the next lowest number, that's where you start, okay? And ask yourself this question. If you're, you know, a four out of 10, as far as being in the right areas, what would it take for you to get to maybe a seven out of 10? All right, ask that question. What would be the simple steps that you could do, okay? You don't need to be on all social media platforms, you know, and, and a, 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 at the exact same time as far as approaching this. Pick one, focus in on it, okay? Make progress and then move on to the next one, all right? And get other people to help you with this, okay? Like your team, um, your friends, okay? Um, other people, or maybe you need to hire somebody to help you on, on this front. All right, that's it, that's all. The one, the two, the three strategies to get more people applying, get more hires, and get you to start dominating your market um, when it comes to being seen as the right prize. And I will see you guys on the flip side. Talk to you soon. Hey, Rockstar, if this video resonated with you at all and you want a proven plan and pathway to take your contracting business to the next level with me and my team of experts, click the link below and apply for a free 50-minute pathway to Profits Call.